Welcome to our Laravel tutorial. Today, we're tackling a specific question that many developers encounter. Our viewer wants to know how to fire an event when a particular column in the user's table changes. Specifically, they have a Boolean column named Verified that defaults to false, and they want to trigger an event when it changes to true. This is crucial for sending notifications based on that change. Let's dive into how we can achieve this. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we're gonna to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you find that resolution. Now, let's continue on to the video. To fire an event when a specific column in the user's table changes, we will utilize Laravel's model events. First, we need to define an event that will be triggered when the verified column is updated. Next, we will listen for the model's updated event in the user model. This will allow us to check if the verified column has changed to true. Now, we need to create a listener that will handle the event. This listener will be responsible for sending notifications or performing any other actions when the event is fired. Finally, we will register the event and listener in the event service provider. This ensures that Laravel knows about our custom event and listener. With these steps completed, your application will now fire an event whenever the verified column changes to true, allowing you to trigger notifications or other actions as needed. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To trigger an event when a specific column in the user's table changes, consider creating a database trigger. This trigger will insert a record into an event table upon an update. You can then set up your application to periodically pull the event table to process these updates. If you're using Oracle DB, utilizing Oracle queues can be particularly beneficial for managing these events. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To trigger an event when a specific column in the user's table changes, you can use the attribute events package. This allows you to fire events based on model attribute changes. In your user model, you can define which events to dispatch. For example, when the verified attribute changes, you can dispatch the user verified event. And that's it. I hope it's helped find you to that resolution that you're looking for. And if it did, please just take a moment, go down, hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. Now, until the next time, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.